Hey guys, Ivan Squantic here, back again with another WWE 2K16 news video, and we have 23 confirmed superstars for WWE 2K16. We also have 9 screenshots, but I made a video talking about the breakdown of that already, so that's pretty good. That's all done, which is amazing, but now we have 23 screenshots, as well as Dude, Love, Dude Loves Entrance and WWE 2K16, so stick to the very end of the video where you can see Dude Love's full ring entrance in WWE 2K16, but we have 23 superstars confirmed for the game, and well, it's pretty much 23 Attitude Era superstars confirmed, and well, that fits in perfectly with the 9 screenshots we had, which are all Attitude Era screenshots, as well as the entrance video, which is Billy Gunn, uh, not Billy Gunn, sorry, uh, uh, Dude Love's Entrance, which is also from Attitude Era. Whoa, why did I just accidentally mention Billy Gunn? Because the first person confirmed, here we go, Billy Gunn confirmed for WWE 2K16. Billy Gunn wasn't in 2K15, and he's coming back, making his return to 2K16. Uh, the ass man Billy Gunn, he was a, a judge on Tough Enough, so he's pretty relevant. But yes, Billy Gunn confirmed for WWE 2K16. Next up, we have Brett the Hitman Hart, also was not in 2K15, he's making his return as well, he's in 2K16, we already saw two screenshots of Brett Hart, and he looks phenomenal, his uh, character looks exactly like him, it's so good, Brett Hart is confirmed for 2K16, his face scanning is phenomenal for Brett Hart, he's, his render just looks exactly like him. So uh, Next up, we have Davy Boy Smith, uh, the British Bulldog, confirmed for 2K16, and uh, so that's pretty cool, British Bulldog wasn't in 2K15, I don't think it was in 2K14 either, so this is a pretty uh, big gap for him, so that's really good, British Bulldog coming back, he's going to be confirmed for 2K16, next up, we had a screenshot of him for him again, uh, he's wanted dead or alive, you know him as Cactus Jack confirmed for 2K16, yeah, we saw a screenshot of him, uh, Mick Foley wasn't in 2K15, so he's returning now, and it's so much better, next up, Yes, he's confirmed. Christian is confirmed for 2K16. He was DLC in 2K15, and he's making his uh, way as a standard on disc playable character in 2K16. Christian, one of the most underrated superstars ever, one of my favorite superstars ever, so it's great he's coming back. Next up, we have Damien Sandow confirmed for 2K16. I, I, don't, I hope he's like. He was with The Miz and he didn't really do anything. Hopefully he's got his updated entrance video, which is, you know, the Alleluia, but it's the rock version of it. But, you know, he never uses it because he's not on TV. But you can see his, uh, his uh, attire is actually his Miz attire. So does that mean Damon Sandow is going to be like Mizdow? I'm not too sure because that gimmick ended quite a while ago. But yeah, his attire is the uh, Damien Mizdow attire. Next up, D'Lo Brown. I definitely didn't think would be making the cut, but look, he's in it. D'Lo Brown confirmed for 2K16. He's obviously part of the Nation of Domination. We saw a screenshot of D'Lo Brown, part of the Nation of Domination. So yeah, that's really good. D'Lo Brown's coming back into 2K16, which is awesome. Next up, Mick Foley once again making the cut. Dude Love confirmed for 2K16. Obviously, we've seen his entrance as well as his, um, his entrance and a screenshot of him. So, you know, we pretty much know he's in the game. But yeah, dude loved the second uh, persona of Mick Foley's coming back. Next up, though, we have Farouk, the leader of the Nation of Domination. We obviously saw a screenshot of him as well because we saw a screenshot of Nation of Domination. And Farouk is part of it. But yeah, if you want to see those nine screenshots that were revealed, go back and watch my video about it. But yeah, Farouk confirmed for 2K16. He wasn't in 2K15. And uh, so yeah, he's making his return again. Hopefully, you know, Farouk's in the game. JBL's in the game. Hopefully we can get some good uh, APA protection in there. Next up, we have Haka confirmed for 2K16. And honestly, I've got to say, Haku... This guy, he's a wild Samoan, I think, but I have no idea who this guy is. I pretty much pride myself for knowing, like, most of the WWE history and everything. But yeah, ha Haku, I think he's a wild Samoan. I have no idea who this guy is at all, but he's confirmed for 2K16. So yeah, this is crazy. You know, I like to think that I know pretty much most of the WWE history, but yeah. I'm, I'm not too familiar with Haku, so yeah, um, I think he's a wild Samoan, 
but yeah, Haku is confirmed for 2K16. Next up, we've got the longest reigning intercontinental champion, the Honky Tonky Man. Honky Tonky Man, did I just say that? Sorry. Honky Tonk Man, who is actually DLC in 2K15. Um, you know, he's part of the Ultimate Warrior Showcase, but yeah, he's uh, added as on disc. He's the Honky Tonk Man. Next up, it's a man we already know is going to be in the game, Jake the Snake Roberts, as we've seen the uh, Austin Showcase gameplay, where it's Jake the Snake versus Stone Cold, and obviously Stone Cold becomes King of the Ring that match, but yeah, Jake the Snake Roberts is, we already know, is coming into the game, but yeah, here he is confirmed, and while he wasn't in 2K15, so it's another person returning. Man, there's so many people that weren't in 2K15 that are coming back to 2K16, and next up, Another person, Jim the Anvil Nightheart, confirmed for 2K16. Obviously, we've already seen a screenshot for him, and, you know, it looks pretty damn good. But, yeah, Jim the Anvil Nightheart is uh, continuing the Heart Legacy Heart Dungeon. So that's pretty, pretty damn cool. Yeah, uh, we've seen a screenshot, and he looks really, really good in that. Next up, Kama Mustafa, who is part of the Nation of Domination, confirmed. For 2k16 so that's really good you know this is the third member from the nation of domination we saw a screenshot for them as well but yet yeah, this looks really good nation of domination looks really really good and now you know we've got um d'lo brown we got Farouk, and now we got kama mustafa um the nation of dominations looking pretty cool oh my gosh look who's next jesus guys ken shamrock is in 2k16 i can't wait to play as ken shamrock man this is crazy ken shamrock's in 2k16 oh i'm speechless this is good this is this is a selling point right here no but honestly i'm actually really excited to play as ken shamrock i just want to see how this guy's gonna play out that's pretty freaking crazy ken shamrock's in the game next up finally we have the third a persona for mcfoley look it's Mankind. Mankind confirmed for 2K16. We have obviously have uh, Cactus Jack and Dude Love, but now Mankind is confirmed for 2K16. Obviously, if uh, Cactus Jack and Man uh, Dude Love are going to be in the game, obviously Mankind's going to be in the game. But yeah, uh, the biggest persona of McFoley Mankind is to confirmed for 2K16. Next up, this is a different one. Paul White is confirmed for the game, and obviously Paul White is the big show. But this is Paul White, not the big show. So it looks like we're going to get the uh, steel cage match between Stone Cold and Vince McMahon, where Paul White actually made his debut in that match. So it looks like that's going to be one of the 2K showcase uh, modes, the actual video. Um, it get the, uh, a match, sorry, a match. Next up, we saw a screenshot for him. Rikishi confirmed for 2K16. We already uh, had a screenshot for him, so I talked a lot about him in that. So yeah, Rikishi is confirmed for the game, which is really, really good. He wasn't in it last year. Next up, oh my god, yes, yes, oh my god. Shane McMahon is confirmed for 2K16. This is awesome. I fucking love Shane McMahon. Shane McMahon is the man... And that he's in 2K16. You can bet your ass. 90% of my the uh, time I'm playing the game, I'm gonna be Shane McMahon. I'm gonna make a bet right now. Shane McMahon's gonna be my u most used character. This is incredible. Shane McMahon's in the game. It doesn't get any better than that. I might as well just buy the game. Just knowing Shane McMahon's gonna be in the game. That's so good. Speaking of wrestler, that's so good. This doesn't really need an introduction. Shawn Michaels. Confirmed for 2K16. Kind of surprising he hasn't been uh, confirmed yet. But I mean, it's obvious Shawn Michaels is going to be the game. I mean, you know, WrestleMania 17, Austin Michaels, that uh, pretty much started the Attitude Era. You need that in the game. But yeah, Michaels is confirmed for the game. Next up, we saw a screenshot for him again. It's Vader. Vader, Vader, Vader time. Uh, Vader's confirmed in the game. I talked a lot about him in the screenshot. But yeah, Vader is confirmed for 2K16. And next up, we have the boss, Vince McMahon. Vince McMahon was playable in 2K14, not 2K15, but yes, Vince McMahon is playable in WWE 2K16. I mean, he's the boss. You pretty much need to play as him. If Shane's in the game, I'm pretty sure Vince is going to be in the game. Especially, you know, if it's a Stone Cold showcase, obviously there's going to be the Vince McMahon rivalry. So it's kind of obvious Vince is going to be in the game. 
And last but not least, we saw a screenshot for him today. X Park confirmed for 2K16. He's got his DX attire. So that's really, really good. X Park is the final person confirmed this week. So those are the 23 confirmed superstars for WWE 2K16. Tell me in the comments who are you most excited for being confirmed for the game. Obviously for me, I've got to say Shane McMahon. That's, that's you know, I didn't expect it. And for him to be in the game, that is incredible. That's so good. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Um, uh, yeah, so click the link in the description below. You can actually watch the uh, Dude Love video, Dude Love entrance video. So, yeah, watch that. Thanks for watching, guys. Tell me who are you most excited for being confirmed. I'll see you in the next one. See ya.